fellow YouTubers, sup, dude, Gecko30 here, and I am back, guys, playing Mass Effect 3 Legendary Edition. So, in the last episode, guys, we managed to escape off Sirkesh and rescue the Krogan female from Cerberus's clutches, as well as the Solarians. But now, until we wait for the cure to be developed, we gotta do a few missions to help out the others. So let's get started, guys, shall we? Alright, let's investigate the Cer Cerberus presence, though. Let's see what Cerberus is up to. Take Edie with us, as well as James. to go. Shepard Service's landing force is away from the Tachunka battlefields. Their target seems to be an ancient ground-to-space cannon facility that hasn't been used since the Krogan rebellions. The site has no obvious military advantage and the Krogan are spread too thin to deal with it. Do we know what Cerberus is up to? No, but we do know that Cerberus doesn't act without a plan. Get in there and stop them. Find out what they're up to while you're at it. We'll get it done. See to it. Hack it out. Looks like Cerberus got that cannon operational, Commander. I'll go back up, get a read on what they're shooting at. Get on it. All right, let's find the control room for those cannons. Kill anything in our way. Let's do this. All right, let's go. credits after the amount I spent. Not the kind of Krogan relic I expected to find. Control center secure. Then I think it's time to test this cannon. First, let me look around. Uh, 
There we go. Gauntlets, huh? Not bad. I think there's pretty much everything around here. It's only two items, I think. So let's go. They cut power to the console. We'll need to get the power back on. Let's move! <laughs> well said, Shepard. They're shuttling in reinforcements, fortifying their positions. See how you these snipers handle against this. This is the one sniper your armor won't be able to protect you from. I love this gun. the power nodes. Ah, shit. These are some powerful snipers. With shotguns. Snipers, I'm gonna get the egg. <laughs> Man, this is one powerful shotgun, that's for sure. All right. Commander, cruiser initiating bombardment. Cannon control restored. Targeting enabled. Coordinates, Lieutenant. Uploaded. Firing. Direct starboard hit, Commander. Target breaking up. Repeat. Direct hit. That's what I'm talking about. All right. Good work, everyone. <laughs> Woohoo! Shepard, with those Krogan cannons operational, Cerberus has actually given us the advantage in that system. The enemy's pulling back, but we think they'll try to seize the facility again. Seems likely. I'm sending an Alliance team to keep it secure. They've got a foothold in a strong defensive position, thanks to you. Glad to hear it. 
Good work, Commander. Hack it out. Woohoo! More credits. All right, getting good here. Now let's see about those Armex Arsenal gauntlets. Commander, you've got a new message at your private terminal. Bray, man. Huh. <laughs> well, that's good. At least there's one battalion that doesn't want to try to kill us. So that's the Arsenal Gauntlets. Uh, not really Shepard style. But still, better than buying them. That's for sure. Now, uh, Extracturian Survivors. Okay, for here... Okay, of course we have Garrus and uh, da, 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 da. we'll take chains with us. Let's give you a better weapon, James. Crash site's a nightmare. Looks like Rex was right about Reaper scouts. Edie, any further intel? The mission brief identifies the Turian commander as Lieutenant Tarquin Victus. Victus? Primarch, son. Huh. Try to raise him. Praetorian commander, what happened here is... Let's just say the Turian code is not forgiving. And that it's his son is bad for the Primarch. Promoting family without merit can bite you in the ass. What's strange is the Primarch knows that. Commander, I have to land well back from the main crash site. Is that the best you can do? Yes, ma'am, but the Reapers seem unaware of our presence. You might get the jump on them. All right, set her down. Let's save this platoon. Did you raise Lieutenant Victus? Yes, but the connection is bad. Patch me in. This is Commander Shepard, Alliance Navy. Do you read? This is Lieutenant Tarquin Victus of the 9th Platoon. We're pinned by Reaper harvesters and taking heavy casualties. Also, there are pockets of my men scattered along the crash trajectory. Lieutenant, I need you to fire a flare so I can find your position. Got it. This sounds bad. Let's move. A secret Turian mission on Tachanka is especially odd. Thoughts? You're the Turian. You tell us. I got nothing, Lieutenant. <laughs> Shh. Sam, quick. We don't want them to call for backup. 
got it. Got him. Escape pod. Our first casualties. Survived the crash just in time for a harvester to take him out. Died in the explosion? Or dragged out and chewed on by husks. on the enemy, and there's an escape pod just beyond. Looks like the Turians are in tough. Enemies up ahead don't know we're here. Surprise on our side for once. I like it. Exactly. Let's go. Cannibals. Take it out. Make sure to forget any stuff around here. Because for here, I don't have a guide of where the items are here, so I need to look around. Keep moving. We need to find the main crash site ASAP. Being the son of Adrian Victus is a lot to live up to. It's a big military name on Palavan. War's expected to run in the Victus blood. Doesn't always work that way. You gotta make your own name. <laughs> You're right on that, James. More credits. Check it out! Got her! Damn, another harvester! Don't let it escape! <laughs> we managed to kill the harvester. I think we saved all those men. Over here! Doesn't look like there's any more items here. Over here. I'm coming. Hang on. Let's 
see something in the head. Shepard here, what's your status? We're in deep. Commander, what's your ETA? Hang tight. We're on our way. Chest plate, huh? Find him, we'll ask. What's coming? And another harvester, too. Take care of him. There's the harvester. Got it on the run. Don't let it escape. this squad here's where politics pisses me off wouldn't the krogan want to blow these reapers the hell off their own planet krogan turian animosity is ancient and intense it's inborn and i need them to work together so let's not complicate things
Lieutenant Victus? Commander Shepard, my men and I are in your debt. Thank you for saving so many. What happened here? He screwed up. Stand down, soldier. These men are dead because of him. I said, stand down. Hey, I just saved all your asses, so everyone just calm down. Lieutenant, what's going on here? I made a bad call. This is all on me. I chose caution and clever tactics over a head-on attack. And my men paid the price. You mean the crash? Yes. We could see on Hollow that Reaper forces were blocking our intended path. Staying on course guaranteed heavy casualties. So I chose a safer route, skirting the enemy. And that took us low and through these ruins. When we encountered resistance, there was no room to maneuver. Suddenly, we were in a fight for our lives. A lot of my men lost that fight. Owning your mistake takes guts, but you have to get over it and move on. Of course. It's just fresh right now. Our mission's still a failure. When we've stabilized the injured, we'll head back to the fleet. You're abandoning your mission? We're down over 30 men. It'd be suicide. What exactly did you come here to do? There's a bomb on the planet. We were sent to defuse it. A bomb? How big? Enormous. Cerberus has it. Lieutenant, if Cerberus has that bomb, you have to finish your mission. Haven't these men sacrificed enough? I understand. This kind of sacrifice is the hardest to ask for, but your men signed on for it, and so did you. My men have lost hope, Commander. Even if I wanted to finish the mission, they don't. It's your job to make them want to. How? Their sacrifice means that others will never face what they faced here today. Remind them that those sacrifices have no honor if the mission fails. Men, I own what happened here today. But we have to carry on. No, we don't. Who cares about a few dead Krogan? It's over. We are Turian. And we will not let Cerberus succeed. Our sacrifice is the difference between life and death for this entire galaxy. Let the heroes of the Ninth Platoon be remembered for performing their duties with bravery. All right, men. Shuttle's arriving any minute. We're moving out. Commander, come with us. We're a shell of what we were. We could use the help. Send me the nav point. I'll see what I can do. Thank you. That'll give us time to do a little recon. See what we're up against. Victus, you have a second chance here. Make their sacrifice count. Understood, Commander. Hope to see you at the rendezvous. Cerberus bomb. What the hell is going on, Commander? And what do the Turians have to do with it? Coordinates Victus gave me place it in the Kelphic Valley. It's a heavily populated area. That's all I know. My gut says something's not right here. What do you suggest? Get the Primarch to come clean. Should we alert the Krogan military? I'd wait. We're in the dark here. krogan turian relations are fragile until the genophage is cured. Let's not push it. And how about this bomb? How many troops does Cerberus have on this? No idea. All I know is, we can't have them detonating that bomb. Keep me in the loop. Hack it out. Primark Victus. Impressive work on Tuchanka. I'm grateful that... Why didn't you tell me about the Cerberus bomb? Why hide that? What else are you keeping from me? I have nothing for you. For our alliance to work, I need to trust you. Our friendship is new, Commander. Would you trust me with information that puts your people, puts Earth, at risk? Why would I jeopardize our alliance by lying to you now? It doesn't make sense. Decisions like these weigh heavy on me. When I was a general, I could pass them up the chain of command. But now, I'm all I've got. Know what I mean? Sure. And? And... And that's all. Wait, there is one more thing, Commander. Thank you for saving my son.
Shepard, test verified. Results promising. Can synthesize for universal Krogan immunity. Good. Then you can put your knife away. The cure's ready? No. Still need transmission vector. Cure useless unless given to entire species. You're usually full of ideas, Morden. You altered the genophage before. There must be a way. Of course, always possibilities, but time limited. Can't create new infection strain from scratch. Groundwater? No, too slow. Voluntary inoculation risky. Population too scattered for airborne, unless... Wait, yes! The Shroud. Constant global dispersion of air particles, built by Salarians to repair atmosphere of Tuchanka. Also used by Turian. We used it to secretly spread the genophage virus. It ended the Krogan rebellions. I'd be careful who you tell that to. Sometimes I understand why the Krogan want to shoot everyone in sight. Those were desperate times. Yes, yes, but useful now. Original genophage strain still in storage at Shroud facility. Can use it as transmission vector, then use Shroud to blanket Tuchanka with cure. You clever little piejack. That's our best shot, right there. Then finish your preparations and be ready to go, Morden. Of course. Ready when you need me. We'll be in Med Bay with Eve until then. Commander, Admiral Anderson is available on VidCom. <laughs> Shepard. So I imagine by now you've wiped the galaxy clean of Reapers and we can all come up for air? Not quite. There have been a few complications. Aren't there always? Hackett filled me in on the crucible. Sounds like you've got some knots to untangle. I'm just glad I could take care of one of them for you. I gather you and Kaylee Sanders were close? I owe you for that one, Shepard. Kaylee and I met almost 20 years ago. We even had a run-in with Saren in his early days. She and I were... more than close. She misses you. I miss her. End of the world has a way of reminding you what you forgot to do. Maybe when the war's over, Kaylee and I will do something about that. You'll see her soon. I can hope. But you've got a bigger problem right now. Like a galaxy full of scared bureaucrats. It's what you hired me to do. Mostly you were hired to kill Reapers. I hope you haven't been sidetracked by all the politics. Nothing I can't handle. What about you? What's happening on Earth? I'll spare you the details, but let's just say a lot of cities around the world have stopped checking in. That bad? You and I knew what we were in for, but everyone else? I don't think the shock's worn off yet. Are you safe? That changes by the hour. I caught a shuttle evac out of Vancouver, and now we're running from Foxhole to Foxhole just trying to stay alive. What about the Reapers? They're harvesting everything that moves. They're focusing on the big cities, which does give us some room to maneuver. You think you can hang on? Hell, we're still just trying to talk to each other. Right now, all we can do is organize the resistance at a local level. No lack of volunteers, at least. Everybody knows what's at stake. I don't know how we'll win this yet, but we will. Even if it kills me. Well, you already died once, and that didn't slow you down. But let's not tempt fate. Keep yourself safe, Shepard. You too, sir. We'll talk again soon. Anderson out. What was that all about with the Primarch? Turian's up to something? It's nothing. Don't worry about it. Uh-huh. All right. <laughs> That's it for now, Rex. Let's get back to work. Ah. <sighs> Yeah. Something wrong? Morden. He got his tissue sample from me, all right. Let's just say scalpels were never meant to cut where he cut. <laughs> oh, gosh. Cerberus is attacking civilians on Benning. We've been asked to help evacuate the planet. All right.
server subductions. Okay, I think we'll do that later then. Right now, let's deal with the bomb. Bring Garrus again with this. So is Liara. Lieutenant, look for somewhere to set your platoon down. Copy that. Talk to me about this Cerberus bomb. It's not Cerberus, Commander. It's... Turian. What do you mean, Turian? It was planted centuries ago, after the Krogan rebellions. The bomb was a safeguard against another galactic war. Brutal, but it makes a certain kind of sense. Put the Krogan down hard if they tried anything. You won't earn trust with tactics like that. But right now, we focus on disarming that bomb. Yes, but Cerberus found it. Detonation means all-out war between my people and the Krogan. Right. Where is it? Those buildings ahead. Cerberus brought equipment to dig it up. The 9th Platoon will cover your flight, Commander. With all this activity, the Krogan have to know something's up. Then we can't fail, Commander. Copy that, Lieutenant. the only one like taking the risk here. Jesus. We can't 
no. We need to move now. Service activates that bomb. Once we reach the bomb, I'll need to reprogram the trigger mechanism. Copy that. No trigger, no explosion. Defeat the Krogan and then plant a bomb on their planet. Pretty extreme, but those were desperate times. After all this, to lose everything in a flash, it's monstrous. She has a point. Huh. All right, guys, so we are going to stop it here for now. So that will be all for this time. If y'all enjoyed this episode, please leave a like and comment and please subscribe. And I do hope to see y'all in the next episode, guys. See y'all later. Bye-bye, guys. Oh.
I will fight.